a focus to more that we're tracking, especially when it comes to the winter session of the parliament on Monday, remember, began on a stormy note with the opposition seeking a discussion on the Adani bribery scandal and the presiding officers rejecting their demands, resulting in adjournment of both houses within an hour of convening is set to resume today. Now, during this session, parliament is expected to introduce 16 bills. WAF bill is likely to be the key bill in this session. The opposition is planning to raise several key issues, including the Adani group controversy, the ongoing violence in Manipur, the border dispute with China and pollution. According to Congress leader Jairam Ramesh, discussions will also focus on social polarization and recent clashes in uh, Sambal, Uttar Pradesh. India Block floor leaders meeting is scheduled for 10 a.m. today. Mohit Bhatt, my colleague, joins me for more. Mohit, a very good morning to you, given the fact that we just gave a quick takeaway of what is expected, but what more can you tell us, especially with the fact that one can um, sort of see this coming, that it is going to be a stormy session? So yes, indeed, uh, this time around, as you rightly pointed out, this will be a stormy session, given the fact that how the opposition party, specifically the Congress, have been pushing for a discussion on the Adani issue and we know for a fact on day one of the parliament, there is various adjournment notices regarding this. Now, we know that how the prime minister himself on the first day of the parliament has appealed to the opposition to come and uh, engage in a, in, a, in, a, in a discussion, debate, and don't disrupt the parliament. And in fact, Prime Minister Narendra Modi attacked the Congress party, saying that those who have been rejected by the people, they are trying to hijack the parliament, and this should not happen. You see, this time around, the opposition parties are raising various issues. Adani, the Adani issue, what has happened in Europe, being the prime minister. Other than that, the issue of what's happening in Manipur is to be raised by the opposition leader specifically again by the Congress. Now, what the opposition says as of now is that the central and the state government have completely failed to control and curb the situation in Manipur. And from past many months, violence has been going on continuously, but no strict action has been taken. And in fact, we know that how the Congress has also uh, sought to remove the chief minister of uh, Manipur, uh, uh, N. Viren Singh, but the center has uh, not done anything in that particular regard. While the center has been saying that Manipur issue is a very sensitive issue, any wrong statement, one wrong statement can also uh, uh, polarize the situation over there and it could lead to severe consequences. So we see, we, we can expect uh, that this, this issue could also be raised by the opposition. Another main issue is that the government plans to build, uh, bring work amendment bill uh, uh, in this session of the parliament. We know that how the opposition, uh, the opposition members of the JTC regarding the work, they have been raising this question that the, the government is trying to infringe upon the rights of the Muslim. While the government says that the work amendment bill is for the poor Muslims themselves, given the fact that how work have the absolute right and uh, the worst of us are the, are the poor Muslims. So today is an important day where uh, the uh, WAP uh, committee meeting will take place, the JTC meeting will take place, and what we have been told is that the officials from minority of this uh, ministry will be uh, giving their um, uh, giving their submission in front of the JTC. Remember, the opposition leaders also sought to extend the timing of the JTC. So all these issues will be raised by the opposition in the parliament. Yesterday was a celebration of Constitution Day, and hence the business did not run in the parliament today. We can expect stormy scenes from the parliament, like this way, like we saw uh, on the day one, where as soon as the Rajasabha and Lok Sabha were convened, there was rough defense. It was a journey.